One of the reasons why I made Mr. Robot was I really wanted to make a show about hacking that felt authentic. I think we did that. Hello, friend. The pilot was one of the greatest experiences I've had in my life. To this day, I don't think I've read a better script. I started it having no idea what it was about and finished it and closed my computer and literally just sat on my couch for like a solid five minutes being like, what just happened? I knew what it was the second I read it. And I remember saying, wow, this show's gonna be really special. Our biggest hope was for other people to find it as special as we did. The whole world of cyber attacks was all new to me and new to most of our audience. We're finally awake! Our tagline for the first season was, our democracy has been hacked. That used to be a cool tagline, and now it's on CNN and Fox News every day. It was eerie how well the show was predicting the world that we live in and would come to know. But I don't think any one of us could have imagined how big it got. It was fast. It felt like it just blew up. You realize, wow, not only is it special to us, critics were speaking so highly of it. Now, Entertainment Weekly wrote a lovely review. The New York Times was writing things about the show. When Forbes said it was on track to be a modern classic, I was like, oh. Whoa. And I just was saying, this this just doesn't happen. I mean, this is incredible. Wow! You did this! There's been so many fun scenes to shoot. When we were shooting the pilot, we were in Times Square and throwing my fists up in the air. I would say the Winners, the one-shot episode. I think it was episode five of last year. The Winners were the most fun because it required everybody. It felt like you could feel that energy of everyone coming together and it really feeling like, OK, we're going to get this. When I kill Susan Jacobs. I loved that scene. <laughs> Sounds like that cancer's acting up again. Looks like it, too. That sitcom episode was so fun and totally different. It almost makes up for them killing my mom. That was crazy and hilarious and just very unusual. When I fired Terrell. I'm not sure what you're saying, Phil. <laughs> That was a really fun scene to play. You know exactly what I'm saying. Exciting time in the world right now. Exciting time. The show gives me hope. It gives me hope about the medium. It gives me hope about the talent that I see around me. It gives me hope about what's coming next from people. It just has given me hope. I always feel a real sense of pride about this show. I, I really like this show. This has one of, been one of my favorite jobs that I've ever had. I was feeling so grateful to be a part of something like that. I will say working with a group of actors that I have worked with has changed me as a person. It's really changed my view on what a TV show can do for people. Not only was it unlike anything I'd seen before, it had a message that was profound and, and strong and a message that the world was in desperate need of. I'm extremely proud to be a part of it.